Greetings, and welcome to today's lesson. In today's lesson, we are going to go over our spelling words for the day. Make sure that you're on page 27 in your spelling, uh, spelling book in the middle portion. As we go through, make sure you're participating with your hands and fingers, breaking the words into syllables and sounds. Make sure you're trying to say with me all the different things I say so that you're learning how to spell English words, not just how to spell this week's words. As we write them, make sure that you use your very best handwriting, including all the appropriate spaces, rules, and markings. The first word is the word equip. So I'm going to equip you so that you can do what you need to do. Equip, base word, equip, equip, e I equip, e equip, e once, rule four, qua, once, rule two, rule one, I p equip, and rule one, a U always has to follow a Q in English words. Rule four, E may say E at the end of a syllable. Now the next word is equipped. So the coach equipped his team to be successful. Equipped, base word equip, ending t. I write equip, and because my last syllable looks like a one, one, one word, so here's quip, qua, ip, single syllable, one vowel followed by one consonant, and the accent falls on the quip, equipped. Okay, so you can hear it, equip. Quip gets the accent. I'm going to double the P and add t. To make the word equipped. E quipped. So equipped. E quipped. Equipped. Okay. E quipped. E once, rule four. Once, rule one. E Twice, rule ten. T once, three, rule twenty eight. Equipped. The last word in this grouping, at least, is equipment. Right? So I'm going to put all of the equipment together. Equipment, base word equip, ending met. I write equip, add met to make the word equipment. Equipment. E. Quip, m, e, n, t, equipment. E, quip, meant. E once, rule four. Qu, once, rule one. Ip, m, e, n, t, equipment. Erase those. All right, the next word is extreme. So something that is um, very wild is extreme. Extreme, base word extreme. X, extreme. X, t, r, e, n, e, extreme. X, extreme. Extreme. Markings. X, rule 20. T, r, e, once, m, once, e, once. Extreme. Now, the next word is extremely, right? So here we're just making it into an adjective, okay? Um, or an adverb, rather, okay? So if I say something is extremely dangerous, okay? dangerous is a, a, a verb describing it, right? Um, and so adding ly makes it into an adverb. Extremely, base word extreme, ending le. I write extreme, add le to make the word extremely. X, trim, oops, sorry. Extremely, yeah. X trim le X t r e m e o e extremely. X trim le X roll twenty t r e once m once e once o e roll six. Right, so X's can never be followed. By S or Z, that's rule 20. Here, the E's are allowing the E to say, um, to say E, job one, sign final E. And this word, English words can't in an I, so use a Y, rule six. Next word is fear. 
Like, do not fear. Fear. E. Rrr. Fear. Here we're gonna use the E at A. Fear. E. Rrr. E. Once. Rrr. Fear. The next word is fearful. So if someone is full of fear, they are fearful. Fearful. Base word fear. Ending full. All right, fear, add full to make the word fearful. Now, when we use the word full as an ending, what do we do? We leave one of the L's off, okay? E, R, U, O, fearful. Fear, full. E, once, R, U, three, full, roll, 22. That is, is that we leave one of the L's off. Erase those. The next word is function. Like, what is its function? What does it do? Function. Base word function. Funk. Sean. Uh, mm, k, sh, uh, mm, function. And here, this C or this this k is a C. Right? Function. Funk. Sean. Uh, mm, k, sh, once, rule 14, ah, uh, mm, function. The next word is functional. So if something works, it is functional. Functional, base word function, ending al. I write function, add al to make the word functional. Funk, Sean, al. Ah, uh, mm, k, sh, ah, uh, mm. At all functional. Funk Sean Al Functional Markings uh, mm, k, sh, once rule fourteen uh, mm, at all functional. And the last word is the word future. Like what will happen in the future? Future base word future. Few, tour. You, t, you, r, e. Again, we hear that sort of that ch sound. Again, that happens when a U follows a T quite often. Okay? Future. Few, tour. You once, rule four. T, you once, r, once, e, once. You may say you at the end of a syllable. E is letting the U say you. And I don't think I described it here on function and functional. Uh, we can't use the SH, so I use TI. That's rule 14. All right. Well, that's the end of our lesson for today. I hope you have a terrific day, and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.